yo <laughs> so i'm recovering from being sick again i um had some kind of a flu i was just recovering from a cold and then and then i had a flu and i'm recovering from that and my throat is still hurting and sometimes i'm getting like a cough like i can't breathe and stuff so i'm trying to deal with that <clears throat> and i'm on my period so double trouble it's double trouble <laughs> it's double trouble um yeah i still have like my throat still hurts and stuff but um i feel like i recovered quicker than i normally would because of the new diet that i'm on uh which is very helpful otherwise i would just be like on my deathbed not that i wasn't it's just that i recovered better this time and it's going away it's just that a uh, throat issue and a little bit of a cough So, I wanted to say that I have problem fatigue. And what that means is I'm tired of dealing with all of my problems. I don't want to be strong anymore. I want to live a life of ease and rest. And <clears throat> I don't want to be stressed out all the time. And at the same time, I refuse to deal with the consequences of people's actions, of their own actions that I have to help them with. I'm not doing that anymore. I barely even want to deal with my own problems. So, yeah. So that's what I've decided. And, um, sorry. <laughs> and I think I posted on my Instagram too, one of my Instagram, something about that, like, I'm lost in this world and I'm done with living my old life. I'm done with all of that. Like, I'm being extremely selfish now and I have to... Well, focus on me, but not stress, not, not like focus on myself in stress, focus on myself in rest, which is what I need to do and ignore all of the bullshit. Oh, on, on my Instagram post, I said that um, if it's going to be constant bullshit, despite um, how much I work on myself or how much I try to change everything um or how much i try to not be trapped in the drug life if it's still going to be constant bullshit i might as well picnic and party and i might as well party and bullshit because nothing changes so that's my current attitude i'm lost in this world i not dealing with anybody's consequences not dealing with anybody's problems and party and bullshit. Gotta go. Talk to you later. Yo, I'm out with you, man. <laughs> I came to the mall because my grandpa at my mom wanted some stuff. And I thought I could be free, but I have to mask up because I mean, you know, compromise. But I'm here at. Let's be clean. So, we didn't buy anything yet. We just gonna sit here and I wanna show you what I got. There's no one around, so. Um, so, I brushed this side of my hair, right? And I didn't brush this side of my hair because when I brushed this side, look at it. <laughs> and I didn't want to have to deal with the frizz. 
Okay, so I went to my surprise. Let me show you what I got. Okay. So I got these shots. It's bright pink. And it's really cute. And I'm gonna wear it with like uh, maybe a t-shirt or maybe like a long sleeve and a, and a, like a vest on top uh, or something. And I also bought jewelry. Oh wait. I got bedroom shoes because my ones were like destroyed. It's really cute. And obviously, I checked out their jewelry section. I checked out their jewelry section. So, oh, that's what I don't like it getting tangled together. Okay, this is what I got. It's earrings, it's black earrings. I've never seen this before and it's metal. So I hope the paint doesn't come off. But it's very cute. Like I love the big hoop earrings. Okay, got that. I got this. It's really heavy. And it's gold. I like thick chunky necklaces and jewelry. Cute. And it wasn't that expensive. I got a huge silver chain. It is so heavy. Look at it. Look at the detail on it. It's really cute. Um, I don't know if you can wear gold and silver together, but I'm gonna do that. <laughs> anyway, wear gold and silver together. And I also bought this. Look how cute it is. Like, I love thick chunky hip hop jewelry and it's so cute it has a, a little green heart and it's like a lot of clasps at the back but I'm gonna wear it all at one time and hopefully it'll look cute on me yeah so my family came here because they wanted to buy medication and stuff and I came here because I want to eat so I'm back home and I got my bedroom shoes on and it's so so cute okay my toes are really ugly so look at the bedroom shoes though it's so so cute and these are my old ones <laughs> okay yeah this is so so cute 